Welcome to Bright Life Creations. In today's video, we are going to talk about your property is not showing. There are some guys that are, that will call me and say, "Hello, Bright. Um, I would like you to help me out this thing. I've opened my AutoCAD and mine. Properties is not showing. I just, I also want to make some changes to some of the objects or the lines or the circles that." I have drawn. I want to make changes to it. So how do we get these things done? Okay. So it, basically, today's video that's what you are going to talk about. So let's say you've opened your AutoCAD like this, and um, your properties is not showing, but um, you've you've drawn a line or an object like this, or let's say a circle also to it like this but here is the case now you want to make changes to their colors now there are other ways that you can make changes to their colors that is uh, sorry that is using the layers or also using the properties tab. but in this case or in this scenario maybe you want to use properties to make the changes to the line and you want to maintain the object on the same layer but you want to change the colors to it now and your properties too is not showing. Now we have we have like um two or three ways to uh, give that command to appear or to make the properties come or show on your desktop. So the first one is using the shortcut, which is Control Plus One, and also second is using the command line just below here where the cursor is moving right now the command line then you type in the command properties or also PR which is also a shortcut to the command or you can go to the view tab here then you come to properties then you click on it and the properties will show here okay now sometimes you will see that the properties are they are is showing though but it is being docked or it is or it is being overlaid on the screen yes let me put it that way it has been laid over the screen like this and now you want to put this thing to let's say a corner or at the top or at the left right like wherever you want to place this thing so what you do is um you hover your cursor onto the palette then you right click then you you will see options showing like move size close allow docking anchor left anchor right auto hide transparency and all this stuff so when your allow docking is not selected like this what you have to do and before you can move it to either left or right or the, at the top you allow the docking and after it has been selected you move it either to the left or the right or wherever you want so if i click on anchor left you can see that my properties palette has moved off the screen to the left side of the screen you could see how it's moved and possibly maybe you don't want your screen to also be crowded or maybe you want more space that you would like to put more things there or more commands or to make your workflow easier and simple so you can change this thing from the text only to icons only and now you can see this big thing has become very small on the screen so in this case when you do it icons only you are going to get a lot of commands you can put a lot of commands on the screen which is going to help you make or move the work faster anybody and how he or she wants it now here's the now you are coming to where or when you can make changes or we'll go straight into this uh, properties and what these things can do for you okay now with a general section here this is where you make changes to the line color the layer of on which the object that you want to make changes to or the selected object is also the thickness of the line or maybe a circle so let me select this circle and I want to make changes. I want to change that color. I could click on this one 
then I'll pick a color. You could see that it changes. Okay, so let's say I want to make it red. I'll just select red and boom, it has changed. Okay, and also I would like to make some small, small things to it. You, you see, so this is what you want to do. Or maybe I want to change the line weight to something like 0 0.5. So you can see that the object has increased in line weight. Oh, sorry, my line weight. You, you see that the moment I've changed it, it's not showing. And this is another challenge that some people face. So this is a bonus for you. So if your line weight is not showing, you can come to the command line and type in LWT, which means that line weight there press enter now wow my, my this is an unknown command so let me go to this hamburger here now you can see the line weight here select the line weight which will show on this tab i click on it and you can see that it has changed okay so this is basically what you can do with the properties palette it helps you to make changes to the color the line weight or it makes the works move faster it makes the work move faster like it improves your drawing your performance when drawing so this is all i can talk to you about the properties palette and if you have any questions put it in the comment section or any suggestions too you can add it in the comment section don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe as well Thank you.